Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are off to B&M to pick up some items for my brand new bathroom. We're going to go and have a look and see what they've got. Pick up some cleaning products and some nice storage products and um, some just some generally nice items to put in my new bathroom. Then what I'll do is I'll do a whole video on how I have organised my new bathroom. If you haven't seen my new bathroom build, I'll link that down below in the comments. Go and check that out after you've watched this video. So I want to pick up some different cleaning wipes to stock in my cupboard under the sink and I do like the fabulous ones so I think I'll get some of those and some others too and I also want to get some cleaning cloths and being now have such a good range of reusable cleaning cloths so I'm going to pick up a couple as well but I just love the range I'm probably going to get these suede ones um, but they do have such a wide range of cleaning cloths so I definitely recommend checking out B&M if you are looking for some. Also need to pick up some cleaning products for my new bathroom. I do like there's a flora bathroom cleaner, so I'll probably grab a bottle of that. And I also noticed they had some different little bath bombs in B&M as well. So if you're looking for some fun fizzies, B&M do have them. If you'd like to see um, a video on the B&M range of bath bombs, then let me know down below in the comments and I'll go and pick some up. Um, I absolutely love this uh, cleaning water, the micellar water, so I'm going to grab some of those too. They do have quite a lot of bath bombs actually. Um, I do like the little cake ones, they're super cute. B&M also has a really wide range of hand sannies, so I'm going to pick up one. I want to pick up one of those reusable pots so I can pour it into there because I think that'll look really nice in the bathroom, so we'll have a look at those too. I do like the bed head shampoos, they always have them at good value. I also want to pick up some storage for the bathroom. There's quite a few different ones to choose from. And I didn't really look at what sizes would fit best under the sink. So I'm going to pick up a couple of small ones and we'll see how they go. Um, I think I like the clear ones better um, than the uh, plastic white ones. So I think I'm going to get some clear ones. I am looking for a laundry basket too, but I don't think they have one in at the moment. But they do have a really good wide variety of boxes I do like the white ones but I think I'm going to go with the clear ones because I really like the aesthetic of those and I absolutely love this urban range in B&M at the moment I just really love the look of it the wooden um, feel so I'm going to pick up a little dustpan and brush to go in the new bathroom as well this is super cute I love the look of it so I'm going to grab one of those because that'll be useful um, for the floor and I think for £2.50 that's a really good value for money I do like those hampers, but I'm not sure they're quite right. I really do want a laundry hamper, but not one quite like that. So here are the pots for cleaning products, um, ones for bathrooms and laundry. I really love all of these. They've got ones for scent, the laundry ones. Um, I'm looking for like a hand sunny dispenser, but I do really like these bottles. But I'm not going to buy any of these today because um, we are looking for the bathroom. Um, so I really like all of these pots, they're so pretty, um, and I have the white dispenser too, this is really nice. You see, these would be great for putting my bath bomb powders in, um, but for now I'm not going to get them. Ooh, I found this really amazing, uh, storage lazy susan so i'm definitely going to get one i couldn't decide between the turntable or the turn box but i think i'm going to go with the turn box and i also i spotted these splash pools i love to get them for my dogs but i don't think they'd really use them but they're mega cute look at them <laughs> i like the little pop-up tents they have for dogs too they're so cute does anyone have any of these things for their dogs and if so do your dog actually use them because i'm not sure mine would but i do like the cooling mats I've had them before, but again, the dogs, my dogs just wouldn't use them. And I also really love this garden stuff too. They're so pretty. There's so many beautiful garden things in Binham at the moment. Definitely recommend you checking them out. I've actually found that B&M are really good for like getting um, some nice big plant pots because they're really good value in comparison to the garden centres. And I love these patio heaters. I definitely love to get one, especially at the moment. The UK weather is terrible. It's not summer at all. And it has some beautiful um, garden furniture sets. I'd love um, one of the sofas that they have in at the moment, but um, they're a little bit too much. So I'm hoping they'll come down in price and then maybe I'll be able to get one. Um, but they have some amazing sets in at the moment. I absolutely love the those sofas and the little two sets too, and the four-piece sofa sets are really nice as well. Um, so maybe one day I'll pick, I'll be able to pick one up. 
I like that barley set. It's really nice. They also have some really nice little wicker baskets. Um, I was thinking about getting one as a laundry basket, but they're just a bit too small. Um, so I'm probably not going to. But if you're looking for laundry baskets, then I would definitely recommend checking out B&M because they have some great ones in at the moment. OK, so now we're moving on to the bits and bobs section that has some really nice decor pieces i'd like to get a decor piece for the bathroom but um i'm not quite sure what i want yet i do have some already nice pieces at home so i'll show you those when i decorate and you can let me know what you think so i need to get a dispenser for hand sunny um and i don't know whether i want to get a toothbrush holder i do like the this one the stone one i think that's really pretty um, they have some nice stone hand soap dispensers too. This is really nice, but it's quite big and bulky. And I feel like it would take up most of my sink. I don't want something quite that bulky because I'm probably not going to fill it. Even though I really love the design of that. That's really nice. It feels really expensive too. This is cute. Nice little stone toothbrush holder. I like the little plates too. They're really nice. I also like this bath mat. But I tend to find that the um, the silicone uh, ones with the silicone bottoms are better because they don't slip like the non-slip ones. Um, I probably need to get a bin as well for the bathroom. I do like that cream bin up there. And they do have some nice bath mats too. So again, they have some nice little mirrors, some nice Lura toilet cleaners. Um, and some more different soaps dispensers as well. I can't decide which one I want to go for. Because um, again, I'm not sure about these stone ones. But I do really like these amber ones. I think they look quite like luxurious, like you're in a posh hotel. So I might get the amber glass bottle um, instead. And I think it's only £3, so that's not too much. So it's quite reasonable um, money. And I do I really like this jar set. How cute is this? It looks really nice. Okay guys, so I'm going to show you everything that I picked up in B&M. So I picked up the bathroom wipes, two different Fabulosa ones. I do love the Fabulosa brand. They're quite useful if you just want to have a quick whiz around um, the bathroom. Um, I picked up some other stuff as well, not just for the bathroom. Some dishwasher tablets. Again, love the Fabulosa brand. Um, some Sephora bathroom cleaner because I haven't got any for my new bathroom. So um, this is really great and it smells great too. So I picked up some Sephora. I picked up a hand sunny tub. This smells amazing. Again, fabulosa it smells amazing i'm going to put it into the uh, dispenser that i brought um i picked up some washing tabbies because always a really good value in b&m and then some bleach um too um and i've also so that's all the cleaning stuff that i sort of picked up i also got um this really cute dustpan and brush which i showed you in store um i love the look of that that will just sit under the sink nicely just to grab if needed um and it will get all those hard to reach places. Just some little toothbrushes. Um, I always like to have some spare toothbrushes in the house. And um, yeah, the micellar water. This lasts ages. I really like it. Lasts a really long time. It does a great job. Um, so I've got some of that as well. Um, it lasts a really long time. And then I picked up some different size storage boxes to go under the sink to keep like the cleaning products in. Um, and also like cleaning cloths and wipes and that kind of thing. So I've got these three different sizes for those things um so hopefully they will fit nicely under my sink um and i also picked up the lazy susan turntables as well which i'll show you in a second um but i like the look of the clear ones it gives me that like sort of home edit vibe um and this is the turntable um which again i'll use to put like my cleaning products in like cloths um like bathroom the bathroom toilet tablets those sorts of things um, so that they're really handy and I can reach everything really easily under the cupboard. So, yeah, I love that. I love the look of that. The hard thing about this is, is getting the sticker off. That's the worst part about those is they put those stickers on and you cannot get them off. Um, I got the microfiber cloths for cleaning and then this is the soap dispenser that I picked up. I really like the amber one. I think it's really nice. And um, for £3, it's really good value. It wasn't too expensive um, and will hopefully look nice on the sink. Now, I picked this up not from b &M, but off Amazon. It's like a wet wipe dispenser just so it looks nice in the bathroom if you have wet wipes on the sides. So I grabbed that too. I'll link that down below in my description if you're interested in picking that up. Um, but I got that on Amazon. 
And there we go. So they are all the other extra little bits that I picked up for my bathroom. I also picked up a little bin as well for the bathroom. Um, eight pounds is a good size. It should fit a lot in. And then you can take the bucket out to take your um, rubbish downstairs and put it out in the main bin. So yeah, love that. I think it looks really cute. I like the colour as well. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below and let me know what you liked best. And don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss out on my next video after this. I'm going to show you how I arranged everything in my new bathroom and all the storage for that too. And if you have haven't already seen my video about my new bathroom installation go and check that one out as well I'll link that down below in the comments I hope that you all have a wonderful magical amazing day wherever in the world and I will catch you all very soon